Well, they've improved to Aris Road no end, haven't they? Yeah, it's coming off fair play to Jack. He's gonna, done a good job. Yeah, with the he's pitch. done a tremendous job with the pitch, hasn't he? Fair dues. Um, are you going to be holding that aloft? Or will that be Dicko? Uh, How's well, it going to work? Hopefully, it'll be Dicko, to be honest. Uh, hopefully, we'll be back out playing. But, you know, obviously, far from picking the cup up at the moment, we've got a huge game Saturday now against Swansea. Um, you know, it's going to be a tough test for us, after, especially going back to back games with them. Um, you know, we did what we needed to do in the league last week, but uh, you know, we also appreciate this uh, completely different game this week. Um, be a completely different Swansea outfit, and uh, you know, cup rugby as well. Um, as we all know, anything can happen on a day. Um, you know, we're lucky to be there after um, just scraping it up in Merthyr. But uh, you know, we'll prepare as well, well as we can now, and hopefully uh, we'll turn up and put a good performance on Saturday. Sincerely hope so. Um, it's it's hell of a promising season, Gar. But is it? Could it be a case of too much too soon? I mean, are we are we spreading ourselves too thinly? Are, are these the dangers we've got to face going into these this end of season now? No, I don't think so. You know, we, all we can do is this this stage of the year just focus on the next game, and uh, the next game for us is you know the semi final against Swansea. Um, so I'm sure it's fresh in the players' mind, and uh, you know, as a supporter of Ponty last year. Um, the disappointment of losing to Kamalin down there. Um, uh, you know, <laughs> they had a big day planned out for the final, but obviously it didn't come off. And uh, I think we all had a big day planned, Gar. I'm sure uh, you know that'd be fresh in the players and supporters' mind. Um, you know, apparently you know, the support was fantastic uh, down in Bridgend last year, but uh, the players, um, for whatever reason, that they you know couldn't couldn't get the right result, but. Um, I think the squad's come on a lot, um, you know, since last year. I think uh, the way they performed in the league this year has shown that. I think Christmas time last year, Ponty were, you know, top end of the table, but fell off a bit. But you know, it's shown the maturity this year and uh, you know maintained it throughout the year. Um, you know, it's great for the club to be involved in three competitions still. Uh, but like I said, you know, all we can do as players is take uh, the next game as it comes. Um, you know, there's no point looking forward to any other games. Um, it's a huge game for us Saturday. Obviously, if we can book ourselves uh, in for the final, um, you know, it will be a huge weight off the players' shoulders, really. And your um, your team talk as as interim captain. Were you expecting that, captain? Uh, no, not really. Uh, it was a bit of a shock, to be honest, because uh, you know when Dicko hasn't played earlier in the year, um, some of the other guys have led the team out, but um, he's obviously pleased for our music for one What on earth is that? We'd have to up the volume, I think, huh? Um, yeah, you know, it's obviously a huge honour, seven or something, I've ever put myself out before to be captain. Uh, I'm quite a quiet guy, really. I haven't got much to say before the games. Um, but, uh, you know, I speak to the players before the game last week and after training and uh, you know thankfully the players responded well and uh, you know we played a good performance in but as to this week uh, I, I think I used all my talk last week so I don't know what I'm going to do this week so was it was it quite an emotional moment for you because as someone who's who's lived and breathed partly for many a year and uh, having never having never been captain before as far as I'm aware um, was it a no, not for Ponty, obviously, but was it quite ner- was it quite a moment for you? Or? Yeah, it was quite nerve-wracking, to be honest, because uh, I didn't want to be the one responsible for obviously losing our home record to start with. <laughs> <laughs> um, Don't worry, I think uh, we'd have found a scapegoat for that one. Well, um, yeah, but still, you know, like I said earlier, it was a huge honour, and uh, it was a big tick in the box for me to look back on when I finished playing, uh, you know, to come back and uh, obviously lead, lead, lead the team out. Yeah, sure. Well... I think we wrap this up here, and, and all I can say is go and enjoy yourself on Saturday. As they always say in the in the Welsh media, express yourself. But um, but I think it's going to be a, I think it's going to be a cracking cracking few weeks ahead by the looks of things. Yeah, and, definitely. Uh, you know, we'll, hopefully uh, you know, we'll have a big day Saturday, and uh, we can look forward to the rest of the season. Big final. Well, let's get past Saturday first. Well, let's do that. Yeah. All right. Lovely. Well, dear Gareth, thank you very much. And public right. to Cheers.